Hello darlings, hello creative ones, welcome back to Ask of Meaning. Welcome back to another tutorial, welcome back to another DIY. And today's tutorial, we'll be learning how to make this fascinator. Wow, this is too much, you can rock this on your top band and you can rock this on your hijab. So I decided to make a creativity for my hijab sister, just look at it. You can rock this too, to church too, just look at it the fascinator i love it the front and the back side so if you are here for the first time don't forget to subscribe and if i subscribe thank you for doing that to my whole subscriber thank you for your love and your support so guys we're learning how to make this fascinator wow that's it on my head wow 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 wow, wow i love this you can follow me on tiktok I am Mina Baby on Instagram, style by Mino, and on Facebook at Fair Day. So just look at this. So let's DIY. Let's DIY. So let's get started. Wow. So if you are beginners, you can learn how to make this fascinator. So, 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 so. So let's get started. So let's get started with the tutorial and um, this is the material I'll be needing for this project. I'll be needing my fascinator base. Just look at this. You can check because of my video now to make your fascinator base. So I made a base. I made a base then after that I spray it with black spray. Then I cover it with this organza material. This is organza material, so I cover it and then sew it around. If you check previous on my videos on the last fascinator I uploaded on my video, you're going to see how I tie that part. I don't want the video to be so that long, so we are going to um, wrap it with your material. I can use the same net and I use um this organza. I just want something different. Then I sew it round. And that is it. I use my needle and thread to sew it round. Now the next thing I'll be doing, I'm going to place it on, on my fascinator. So we'll just check um how I made this wound, how I made the um, fascinator net. If you're familiar with all my videos, you're going to see it there. I later show you how I wrap it. Just see what I'm doing. It's so so easy to do. So you just need to untread to sew that part round. You just need to untread to sew it round. Make sure you sew it so neatly. Just and uh, look at it and um, avoid to sew it and look at what I'm doing. It's so so easy to do. Just see what I'm doing. It's so easy to do. I'm going to choose a needle and thread uh, to sew that part tight. It's so easy that's what i'm doing so the measurements i use for the wire the measurement i use for the wire i just can use them um, 36 you can use 40 inches just depend on how wide you want to, to look like and this is my flower this is my pocket flower this is called a um, pocket rose flower so i'm going to place that on that just look at this video and um, look at this. If you don't really understand what I'm doing, so this is um my belt. I'm still going to cut it. I don't want it to be so long like this. And um, I'll be using this. Um, that's it. Um, just look at it. Um, just look at it. It's a little bit wide, and I fold it into two. I'm still going to show you the measurement I use for this. I'll be using this to on the this fascinator. Just see what I'm doing. Just look at it. So it's just see how wide it is this. Then you fold into two. You fold into two. Then you bend it just like that. And you see the way my hand is. And you're going to use a needle and thread to sew it down. You're going to use a needle and thread to sew it down just the way I'm doing it it's just what I'm doing 
use a needle and thread to sew it. You can use your hot glue to sew it to just depend on how, how you love it and how you want to do it. So keep doing that. Keep sewing it. Just see what I'm doing. Just see what I'm doing. Sew in and out. You keep sewing in and out. You sew in and out just the way I'm doing. If you are new to this, this channel, don't forget to subscribe. Just see what I'm doing. And we keep doing this. And just look at this. Then you're going to tie it. So you're going to tie it. Just see what I'm doing. I'm going to tie it. I have a lot of videos on this channel. Just check all my videos. Watch my videos from the beginning to the end. Comment, like, share with friends and family. Just share with friends and family. That is important. So I'm going to cut this part out. So I've already sewn my belt. Then I use it to form this type of shape. This round shape. I'm going to glue it to heat to just see what I'm doing. You do the second one the same way you did the first one. In this part, I show you the measurements. I show you the measurements. I have um, just look at it. I have look at it just six inches and um, look at it. And the wideness is eight inches. So I have six inches by eight inches. We are going to sew it and turn it out. And after turning it out, we are still going to fold it just like this. And you bend it like this. And you sew it with your needle and thread. The way you sew the other part with your needle and thread. And um, that is it. So you are going to glue this part with your hot So after you have glued your accessory, so the next thing we do now, you're going to embellish it. You're going to use a pearl and you're going to use a stone to embellish it. Just look what I'm doing. It's so easy to do. I use my basic styles on to do this part. I use my basic styles on to do this part. And if you're gluing your basic styles on, make sure you use your hand to press it down. So it's not going to be falling off. When your client is using it, or even when you are using it, I later remove the pearl from it and I use my shiny pearl on it. Just see what I'm doing. So, so, so easy to do. Look at this. Um, you keep doing this. Um, look at it. And you can still add feathers to it, just depend how your client. So, that is the final look. Just look at the final look, guys. So that is it. You want to add more pep to it, you can do that. And you want to add more feathers to it, you can do that. Just look at this and just look at it. You can rock it and you can rock it to your church. You can rock it out. And as a job sister, you can also rock it out. Just look at this. So this is so beautiful. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like and don't forget to share and that is the back view the back view too is so beautiful you can just put this at the front you can put it at the back it just just changes just depending on how you love it so we're going to be seeing next time on my next video